caramel custard caramel custard i have little extra sweet cravings than other people once in a while i need to eat really nice sweet stuff and one of the easiest and the first recipe i learned in the college is caramel custard the same one when you add cream it's called creme brulee so for this recipe i'm taking around 600 ml of uh, milk that means in us you can buy half and half in this add 50 grams of sugar and there is additional sweetness that comes because of the caramel we put on top and that is going to look very beautiful we're going to add 3 eggs always break the eggs separately if i break the eggs in this and if the egg is spoiled the entire thing will be ruined also in this add some vanilla essence nicely whisk this whisk it well till their sugar melts away always strain this so that if there is any strands of egg white that can be removed making caramel is very easy add sugar switch on the flame you don't need to add water just let it melt now you will start seeing how the sugar will melt and on the medium heat when everything melts slowly it will start coloring so let this heat on a slow flame now without adding a drop of water the caramelization will happen and if you are using a spoon also use a steel spoon you can see how this is melting and let it melt further and it will start changing the color you want to get a nice golden color that's when your caramel will be perfect on further heating this will start becoming darker in color and some people prefer it even more darker but for me you know nice golden color is what i prefer look at it you are not supposed to stir this on a heavy bottom pan when you do it you will get it perfect now the color is changing rapidly add little by little caramel even in the silicone ones you can just pour a little bit if it gets very darker then the color the taste will change to bitter egg mixture pour it in this ha ah, you know how much ever you want even in the small cups even in the silicon molds you can pour this perfect this is a love cup for me and queen victoria nice beautiful the smaller ones will cook faster so after around 20 25 minutes remove the small ones and little more time even the bigger ones will be done put it in the oven at 180 degree centigrade for around 25 minutes it should be done once they are set you can easily unmold and you will have nice beautiful caramel custard see this caramel is what very very tasty beautiful and try a bigger one bigger one be careful and you will start seeing the caramel honey like caramel will start floating beautiful caramel custard it is so tasty that you will just love it sometimes you see a very delicate golden kind of nest threads silky kind of thing that is made also with caramel sugar so i have taken some more sugar no water added let it melt and when it gets the color you take a fork dip it in it and you make the threads you going to see how it is done you have to let it slightly cool down after a certain time of cooling it will start forming strings that's when take a bowl like this and just fast do this so dip it fast do it like this you can see that golden threads are forming here so these threads is what will make it really nice these are caramel golden uh, strings so make this and look at this beautiful strings what we do is we just make a bowl like this and put it on top of the caramel custard and with the golden nest caramel custard is so delicious just wow a small mm it is got that fruity honey kind of flavor with this awesome uh, custard it is also called as flan and many other names mm my goodness whenever this is made at home we just fall in love with this this is so good mm and when you eat one you eat two 
and you are left with a small one. Still, you got to do ding chick, ding chick, ding chick, and look at this so beautifully well said and the caramel. Mm. Just love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. As I told you, caramel custard is one of the first desserts we have learnt in the college. The first time we made like just beaten eggs, milk, sugar and you put it in. When it came out, how beautiful and colourful it looked, said man this is something. But this is so basic that even a 7 year old kid, except the caramel part that needs parental guidance, but otherwise a 7 year old kid can easily do this.